everyone. I'm Jane Mohan. I'm here with David, the owner of ResTech Solutions. And I'm going to be interviewing David today to learn more about his company and all the wonderful services that he provides. So David, how are you doing today? I'm good. Thank you. And yourself? Oh, fabulous. These spring days, I just love them. So tell us, David, why did you start ResTech? So I started Restech Solutions because it's something I always wanted to do is have my own business. I also grew up around a family business, so it really had a lot of that exposure. And I ended up seeing a, a big need um, kind of in the IT service space, you know, for a company to really get out there and provide a, a better quality of service. Um, so that has kind of been my motivation. And so what kind of services are we talking about, dude? So we're talking about managed IT services. So at a very um, kind of high level overview, we will essentially come in and with our clients and we will act as their internal IT department. So we will handle all of their technology needs for them. All right. And so when did you start your company? So I started ResTech back in 2011. I believe it was in August of that year. And for many years, I ran it as a side business. I was still working a full-time job back then, trying to get my business started. And I went full-time with ResTech. It was in about mid-May of 2018. Wow. And, and tell us, David, who's your ideal client? Who, who's your target market? So our target market in a broad sense is going to be small businesses with one to 50, five zero employees across any industry with the exceptions of healthcare, government, and nonprofits. Our more targeted approach who we're looking for is that same broad category, but we're focusing more on the professional services space. So uh, our lawyers, um, attorneys, CPAs, accountants, um, business consultants, anyone who works in the professional services space. And so when did your love of technology get started and what is it you like about it? So I really started to develop more of a passion for technology back when I was in high school. I remember, I think I was about a sophomore when we got our first uh, wireless network at home. And that was back in back when we still had kind of the larger clunky laptops and you plugged in a big card into this um, kind of rectangular slot on the laptop. So this is way before you had all the uh, devices via USB and internal devices. So this is when why the Wi-Fi was yet to be built into the laptops themselves. So somewhere you got this technology, you started learning the love of it. Um, and when did you feel or realize that you want to do this business? So that again, that kind of developed, you know, while I was in high school, um, you know, because when I first started, you know, I actually got into the, to the business club at school and started taking a lot of uh, business courses and the technology courses. So that's really where I started to develop my skill set and my passion uh, for this field. And uh, tell us, David, what part of Houston are you located in? Uh, we are located um, kind of just west of the gallery area off of Westheimer. In, in Houston, Texas, yes. Yes. Um, so how did you come up with the name ResTech? So originally when I started, I was kind of focusing more at the time, again, being on a, on a part-time basis, uh, more on the residential side. So the original name came about, uh, you know, from residential technology. And then, you know, we wanted to provide solutions. Mm -hmm. So that's how I came up with the name uh, ResTech Solutions. But we now focus primarily more on business, um, so the meaning of the name has changed, but we are here essentially to serve and provide a uh, valuable service to our clients. And that brings...